right there and some, that Riley hits it hard. That's why you can't relax in these scenarios. Here, there's some of the D by Ayala. Shot clock is at nine. Rocket Watts up in town. This is incredible by Jackson Davis. I mean, he's going from the top of the key. He's on the block. He's on the He's rebounding. He's going against four or five different guys. You saw him against what did get with Iowa. He broke that baby open. Watts, a fadeaway. Jalen Stick Smith off. Oh. And to replace those guys, it's, it's always very difficult. Rocket Watts gets free for three in Michigan. And Jacob Young got some things going in the first half, largely off of his defense. But Ron Harper Jr. has been able, um, able to get on track. Montez Mathis has not had the kind of game. 10-7 lead for Michigan State. Now they protected in traffic. Nice little pin down for Hauser. Well, he looks more alive and alert, doesn't he? He does. He's been very engaged here in the first half of the opening half. Yeah, they need people to compliment Henry in particular. Shot clock winding down. Watts can make it happen quickly. Not a natural shot for Bajanashvili with the left. Especially against the length of Bingham. And Watts' pull-up is true. It's easier to count. It's easier to count the games where he doesn't get reprimanded. <laughs> I love Bob here. I've always had. The man is passionate, that's for sure. Rocket win. If you wanted to throw the ball in the post, I get being unselfish, but to me, it's a day ice cold to start this one. Lots around the Sissoko screen. Now driving inside. Got that one over the outstretched tree on its way. Just off the front iron. And look who comes up with it. Langford. Now Watts. Little for post-ups and easy baskets. And Iowa does a great job of passing the ball up the floor in transition. Rockets floater from the foul. How about that for goal setting? The tip there for Aaron Henry, a good defensive stop. They get it out to Watts for the easy two that time. Jackson in a little bit in the Illinois game, lefty. Watts low by. Clean looks. I'm chasing off screens. I got this dude. Rocket Watts. That was a 16, make it a 19 point lead for Norfolk State at one point. And a 16-0 run for App State. That's a friendly battle. Watts, fend off. It's a play on. Watts, cheesy. He'll attack, and Dosumo has it tipped away and going the other way. Henry with the challenge. Ahead comes Watts. He'll push in the end. And play up good. Leave that for me, not the players. This is a bad possession. Might end up good, but this is a bad possession. Rocket Watt. Hoiberg gave it up. Timer down to 11. Watts, spin, pull up. Oh. Michigan State looks poised to hit them with a run. Let's see how Nebraska responds. Well, no field goals in five and a half minutes and counting now for Nebraska. Oh, for their last six. Here's the drive and dish and kick out. So 17 point lead. And Ohio State turns it over. Blankford. There's the kick. Regular season here in the Big Ten. These two teams played just three days ago. Watts contest for Watts. Ten to shoot. Tight defense there from Smith. Nice defense by Wagner. Rocket fires. Kaboom. Hooks shot. He's worked on that little three-pointer as well. Doesn't take too many of them, but... Around the rim, finding people, screening, rolling, all the dirty stuff. The young man who has overcome so much, multiple lowered legging. Barnes stayed with Langford. Watts catch and shoot. Got it. Ships. And neat that they won two state titles together with Trevor's dad, Scott, as the head coach at Stevens Point. Down the lane, little floater. Michigan State coming in 4-0, beat Eastern Michigan, Notre Dame, Duke, and then Detroit. But again, that Detroit game Friday was close, 83-76. And here's another in-state team giving them all they can. Hall starting the second half for the Spartans. 
trying to set a screen, letting it rip. Malik Paul is on the floor, too. A little runner. Don't quite grasp, and, and you understand that. I mean, none of us got it our first year. Get your work done early. The freshman trying to stay with Rocket Watts. There's that screen again from Kithier. Watts the beneficiary. Mr. Oh, George, he did a great job for Illinois because Colbert got a little foul trouble. And he's a terrific athlete, Colbert, for his size. 298 pounds, 7 foot, agile, mobile, but not fragile. Oh. Points the outside. Watts giving it up to Langford. Good overplay defensively there by Aaron Wheeler. Shot clock down to 10. Watts pulls up at the key. Drops it by the Spartans. Jack Hoiberg also in the ballgame. Jack Hoiberg could play at a number of Big Ten schools. Boy transfer, Kobe Webster. Webster doing a nice job defensive. Look at the smaller player, number 10 down there. He forces Joey Hauser all the way out to the corner. Rocket Watts baseline with the foot. And guess who? Kithier with the offensive rebound. And that gets you an extra 20 seconds. Rocket Watts, the floater and the finish. Just 19% this year for Gabe Kalsher. The guy that shot 41% from three his freshman year. He can make shots, but it just shows how contagious and also mental it can be when you're not shooting the ball well. Gabe Kalsher almost looks like he's wishing it to go in. Two points in nine minutes of play. He picked up a couple of fouls early, but they leave him alone on the transition. He sets his feet.